Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. One of the handiest features of Adobe Acrobat is its customizable Quick Tools toolbar. Even though Acrobat has a wide variety of tools and features, many users find that they use a few tools more than the rest. By customizing the Quick Tools toolbar with features that you access regularly, you can streamline your work process and save time. In its default setting, the Quick Tools toolbar contains buttons which execute some of the most commonly used commands in Acrobat. The Quick Tools toolbar also contains the Edit Current Toolset button. This button, which looks like a small gear, will launch the Edit Toolset dialog box when clicked. When you launch the Edit Toolset dialog box, notice an area at the top which reads Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar. This area underneath Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar shows you the buttons in the section of the toolbar that can be customized by using this feature. At the top right of the Edit Toolset dialog box, you'll see four buttons. The first one is the Add Divider to Quick Tools Toolbar button. Dividers are non-functional elements that are primarily used to organize groups of buttons. To the right of the Add Divider button, you'll see the Move Left and Move Right buttons. To the right of those buttons is the Remove from Quick Tools Toolbar button. To remove a button from the Quick Tools Toolbar, click the button that you want to remove shown within the Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar area to select it. Notice the button's background color turns light blue to indicate it is selected. Then click the Remove from Quick Tools Toolbar button. If you click the Save button at the bottom of the dialog box, the selected button will disappear from the Quick Tools Toolbar. To add a button to the Quick Tools Toolbar, first find the button to add within the button groupings shown at the left side of the dialog box in the Choose Tools to Add section. You can expand and collapse the button groups by clicking the title of each grouping shown. When you find the button you want to add to the Quick Tools Toolbar, click it to select it. Then click the Add to Quick Tools Toolbar button in the middle of the dialog box to add the selected button to the Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar area. If you click the Save button at the bottom of the dialog box, the button will then appear in the Quick Tools Toolbar. You can also arrange the buttons in the editable section of the Quick Tools Toolbar so they appear in whatever order you like. To change the order of buttons from left to right, click a button to select it and then click either the Move Left or Move Right button to move the selected button either one space to the left or the right each time you click. You can continue clicking these buttons until the selected button is in the position where you want it. To separate the buttons into button groups within the Quick Tools toolbar, you can add a divider to the toolbar. To do this, click to select the button in the Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar area that is to the left of where you want the divider to appear. Then click the Add Divider to Quick Tools Toolbar button. The divider will be added immediately to the right of whatever button was selected. Once you add the divider, you can move it to the left or right just like you moved the buttons by using the Move Left and Move Right buttons. You can also click the Remove from Quick Tools Toolbar button to delete a selected divider if needed. Once you get the Tools to Show in Quick Tools Toolbar area looking the way that you want, simply click the Save button at the bottom of the dialog box to save your changes. The dialog box closes and you'll see that Acrobat's Quick Tools toolbar has changed to reflect your selections. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.